everyone. Happy Friday. My name is Delaney Edison and I am the Director of Operations here at West Columbia Gorge Humane Society and I'm back today for our next installment of Friday Pet Tips. Today I'm going to show you how to medicate your cat. So for today's demonstration, I'm going to show you how to administer a liquid medication, a pill medication, and then an eye medication. Before we get started though, the best thing to do is make sure you have all of your supplies with you. So I like to have a towel because I will wrap my kitty up in a little kitty burrito, which I'll show you how to do. I have a pill administrator here. It makes the oral pills go down a little bit easier. I have my one mil oral syringe to show you how to do the liquid. And then I have artificial tears to show you how to administer an eye medication. With me today, I have Sasha Popsicle, a WCGHS alumni, and she's gonna show you how we administer medications. So Sasha gets a little grumpy for the medication administration, so I use a technique called a kitty burrito. So I'm gonna lay a towel down, and you're gonna lay it horizontal. So then this is the uh, easiest part to get that burrito going. So you wanna make sure you tuck in all of their feet so they can't get away when you're administering. So you'll lay her down, take the front part of the towel, wrap this, no, Sasha. You're gonna take the towel here and wrap this up here. This will tuck her front feet in. We're gonna wrap her around and then come back around the top just like you're making a burrito at home. And this here, <laughs> I know. And this here wraps her legs up, so all I have to do is worry about her head, and that's where I'm gonna be administering the medication. So first, if you have a pill you need to administer, I highly recommend getting what we call a pill popper. And this here, you place the pill in the top, and it just gives you a little bit more leverage to be able to easily administer. So I'm gonna turn Sasha to the side. I know. And to get the pill in, if you grab the cat just behind the head here, you'll feel the jaw. That's gonna be your leverage point to be able to easily tilt the head up. And then I'm gonna take my pill popper and come in on the side. And if you look in a cat's mouth, they have a gap between their canines and where their molars are starting. And that's gonna be the easiest area to insert the pill popper. So I'm gonna tuck it in on the edge and then you would push down and administer. Once you have the pill in their mouth, you gently tilt their head up and rub their throat. That'll help them swallow. Good job, Sasha. Are you ready for the next one? All right, so the next one we're gonna administer is a liquid medication. After you have confirmed the dose on the bottle and you know how to correctly read your oral syringe, you would drop your medication. Let's say she's getting 0.4 mLs today. Again, I'm gonna grab her head. I'm gonna grab right on that jaw connection and I'm gonna tilt her head up. I know. And go ahead in that same spot between the canines and the molars starting. That's where I'm gonna tuck my syringe in and then I would push that in and again, gently rub their throat. The burrito makes it really easy to administer. The last medication to administer is our eye meds. Again, Sasha's not on any medications right now so I'm just using um, an eye lubricant. Again, you can grab their head here on the jaw, tilt their head up, and then I like to use my free index finger to gently lift the eyelid up, and then I use my pinky on my other hand and gently lift that down. So I open effectively, opening the eye, and then I can place a drop of the medication and close their eye. Good job, Sasha. No harm, no foul, babes. <laughs> All right. And then she's free to go. And that's how I would administer medication to a cat who's not food motivated. If you're one of those lucky ones out there who has a food motivated cat, I would recommend picking up pill wrap or a pill pocket and hiding the pill treats inside of this. Thank you guys so much for joining us today and I will see you next time. Bye.